hi guys welcome or welcome back today we're in the bathroom we're going to wash the hair and i might sound like i'm in a closet but yeah because i'm in the bathroom i pre-pulled my hair last night before i went to bed with coconut oil and if you have not seen my video on pre pulls i will um link it in the description box or at the end of the as the end screen so here's my hair it is wet because I've, I've been sweating all night but yeah i twisted it up and i'm just gonna wash it in twists because it takes me a long time to detangle my hair when i wash it um straight as it is without like twisting it so we're in the bathroom featuring garnier whole blends so these are the this is the shampoo of choice today and the condition of choice today i'm using the um, coconut oil coconut butter it tames and controls frizz i do not have the conditioner for this one but i have another garnier um, conditioner and this is the moroccan argan oil that i love this i use this a lot uh this uh, is my first time using this but this conditioner i do use a lot so i'm going to start by just saturating my hair with water sorry sometimes i'm speaking british british so i like to saturate my hair with water but first i give myself a little massage So I basically just put on the scalp and massage that in and because my hair was pre-pulled and there was a lot of like oil on my scalp that's a, that has already lifted up the dirt so I'm just gonna you know massage it in and it will take off all the all the dirt and then I'll just work it out to those strands so after the first application I will um, add some water so that it lathers up and then I'll work it out to the strands and then I'll repeat the process before I go on to conditioning The second time around, the shampoo ladders up more because there's no more oils on my hair and there's no dirt. Now I'm going in with a conditioner. I'm just going to apply that on the strands and not uh, on my scalp because if I apply that on the scalp, it's gonna be hard to get out because my hair is twisted. And I don't think you should be doing that anyways because sometimes when you don't rinse it off well, that's, that's where the itchiness comes from. You get itchy um, because of that conditioner that you didn't rinse off well I'm twisting it like this to force the conditioner to get into the strands so this time I'm going to hold it up for a few minutes while I shower so that I let the, shampoo, the conditioner do its job before I rinse it off
so the conditioner has been rinsed off a good wash day does not end with just washing so i'm going to just moisturize and um that's it for today so i i'm going to use my diy moisturizer in here there's a conditioner a, a conditioner um glycerin water olive oil so i'm just going to apply that and then i will seal with an oil so this is the washed hair i always cover my hair after washing with a microfiber towel so that it does not dry out before i oil it the edges are laid so i'm just gonna apply this generously and then maybe retwist it later but for now i'm just concentrating on application and making sure i reach every stand every strand so as i apply i squeeze it in because my hair is twisted i squeeze it in to make sure it penetrates even I also have the smoothing oil, like the same um, shampoo that I used, but it's almost like non-existent, but I'll use it. Also have all the same as the conditioner that I used. It's also like ending. So where this one ends, I'll go in with this one. As you can see, I love them and I use them a lot. So I'll, pu I'll put just a little squirt and use it over the hair like that so i'll do that for the whole hair and then maybe i'll take off one by one and retwist them so that they look better than they do right now and because i want my hair to retain maximum moisture i always um go in with a softy grease on top of it i find that this helps my hair retain moisture for weeks if i if i decide to go weeks without washing it it always like it's always like still moisturized i do not need to use a brush today because it's not as it's not it's not bad it's not really tangled so i'm just gonna twist it so this is the difference of a freshly twisted and the one i washed it in As I'm twisting it, you can almost see product. You can actually see product over it. Personally, personal opinion, that's how I like to saturate my hair with uh, product, especially grease, because um, it helps protect it and keep it moisturized. Because my hair is long, I find it easier for me to um, wash it while twisted, because if I wash it with it out, it's so much work to put it back together into a decent state after I'm done washing um, that means I'll have to like mostly comb it like you know detangle with a, um, with a comb or brush so I find this is the best way for me it's just that today I washed it from straight twisted which was not a very smart move but then and that's why it's like so hard to take out right now because it was straight when I twisted it and I washed it and then it curled up against each other. It takes much longer to take out, but I prefer this than uh, the other. Also guys, let me know in the comments if you um, enjoy this kind of content from me because I'm actually planning to do a whole series of shampoos and conditioner and um wash days so let me know if you enjoy this type of, co of content so i can you know saturate you with this content actually i'm planning to test like most con most popular conditioners and shampoos out here in the market i feel like i've for years i've always used the same same thing but um Maybe I'm missing out on something. Maybe I'm <laughs> Maybe I'm just like in a cocoon where I don't know what else is happening. So I would like to 
experience all these other products and you know i can be your guinea pig and uh, test them out for you in case you're curious i would like to get out of my comfort zone of doing this the garnier that i use today is not like my constant but the next um the next wash day i'm going to use my staples what i use all the time so stay tuned for that and if you have a favorite that you'd like me to you know review or test out let me know in the comments i would love to because i'm trying to experience all these mainstream shampoos and conditioners this grease also defines your curls really so if you're doing a wash and go you can actually use this to define your curls like that because i need to go somewhere I'm going to slap these onto the ones that I have not applied to in hopes that by the time I come back to still be hydrated. But if it won't be, I will just spray a little water onto my hair and do the process again. So I'm thinking I might not come back to finish this video. It was a wash day video anyway. Uh, I don't need to do the twists up here. Um, so thank you for watching this far if you're new please consider subscribing because i have great content lined up for you this year and if you're not new here you're a member thank you for staying and thank you for watching this video to the end if you have watched this far that's a sign that you should subscribe and i will see you on the next one ciao